What's going on guys, Nick here with another update on the Godzilla 2017 anime film. So of course we all know now the official title is Monster Planet and we also have a ton of new info coming at us from Anime Japan 2017. Now in this video we're going to just be breaking down the characters of the film and provide a short bio on who exactly they are. First up we have Haru Sakaki who is the lead character. He's a 24 year old captain that lost both of his parents in a Godzilla attack and he holds an extreme thirst for revenge. Next is Metaphos. He's one of the two alien characters and he is from the Exif species who's a civilian priest and lieutenant colonel in the army. A man of great virtue who earns great respect by overcoming borders. He's a philanthropist and he is also quite understanding of Haru. Next is Yuko Tani, a 19 year old sergeant major in the army. She was raised with the orphaned Haru and was below him in school. She is fond of designing and remodeling weapons. Following her is Martin Lazari, a 34 year old major who serves as an environmental biologist in the army. He's a specialist that analyzes the truth of the altered global ecosystem on Earth following the years since the kaiju invaded and took over the planet. After him is Adam Bindelwald, a 21 year old second lieutenant that is skilled as a landing boat pilot. He's the youngest officer and is in constant awe of Haru's actions. Last up is Mulel Gog, the second alien character who's the technical officer in the army. His species, the Bilsard, have generally strong bodies and he is an expert engineer. So pretty cool stuff here, definitely liking the look of the cast so far. I like that they actually have two alien characters, I think that's a really nice touch because we do know that in the timeline at this point the humans have actually left Earth and they've colonized other planets following Godzilla basically taking over the planet and years of different kaiju attacks. So this group of, you know, characters is going to have to come back to Earth, figure out what happened to the planet, how to fix the ecosystem, and how to defeat Godzilla once and for all. So I'm definitely looking forward to the film, obviously. It's pretty cool that we're finally going to be getting an animated Godzilla film. Well, this is the only film, actually, because they announced that this would be the beginning of a new trilogy of anime films, with them being exclusively on Netflix and releasing in theaters in Japan, I believe, a couple months before. I think it releases theatrically in November, and then it should be on Netflix shortly afterwards. So leave your thoughts down in the comment section below. What do you guys think of the cast of characters that we have here and what are your thoughts on the movie so far and how it's shaping up? Thank you guys again for watching and for more on Godzilla Monster Planet and the other updates in the Godzilla universe, stick with the Hybrid Network.